With Alex's free kicks, it all starts with the why. So, please take a second and walk through this with me. All the contestants here tonight are all interested in a college future. The University of Central Florida, it's one of the largest colleges in the nation. It has over 65,000 students. So, could you imagine if every single one of those students suffer from poverty? Well, to take it back home, there are over 65,000 children in Palm Beach County that can barely afford food, let alone soccer equipment. I believe Alex's Free Kicks has the ability to put a ball at all of their feet and make them all active. I've been playing soccer ever since I was four years old. It's my passion. Over the years, I've gathered soccer balls and soccer cleats that have just filled up my garage. This was my inspiration for Alex's Free Kicks. Amazon, Microsoft, Google, Walt Disney, and Mattel. All of these extremely successful companies share one thing in common with Alex's Free Kicks. We all started right out of our very own garage. <laughs> My garage is more than just a regular old garage. To me, it's about giving, it's about leadership, and it's about making a difference. My garage is where Alex's Free Kicks was born. Over the last three years, I've gathered soccer balls and soccer cleats. I've collected over 600 soccer balls and 300 cleats. Around two years ago, I reached out to the Boys and Girls Club of Palm Beach County and I've been distributing throughout the county ever since. My goal is to collect 150 soccer balls and 75 cleats, twice per year in around 10 different communities. This would put us around 15,000 soccer balls and 7,500 cleats in the next five years. The way I'm gonna do this is, well, I wanna expand beyond Wellington into around 10 different communities. The way I'm gonna do this is I'm gonna have a champion program. These champions will be high school students that will represent and manage each community. As a 501c3, these champions will be able to receive community service hours. This program is not only good for the children, but it's also creating future leaders throughout our county. But I need a little help to kick things off for my goals, pun intended. <laughs> I want to talk to you guys about a couple things that I need to sustain Alex's free kicks. First, I want to set up Alex's free kicks as a 501c3 in order to collect donations and give community service hours out to the champions. Next, I've been collecting soccer balls out of old cardboard moving boxes for the last three years. This is just not the right look for my organization. I want to get good looking and branded boxes for each community. And finally, I need current and ongoing dollars in order to properly sustain the website and promotion. So in total, I'm looking for about $15,000. Which of you investors want to become a champion? <laughs> 